We start with breaking news. Minneapolis Mayor Jacob Fry has released the body camera footage. Police body camera video was released Sunday night. The police body camera footage from the shooting death of Thurman Blevins is now public. More protests are expected in Minneapolis. Tensions are high. Hundreds protested blocking intersections and rail lines. Officers Justin Schmidt and Ryan Kelly were responding to this 911 call. It's a guy walking around, he's shooting off his gun. All right, what's our description here? Black male in his 30s, white. Officers man. arrived on the scene and Black noticed Blevins up, with a there. gun in his waistband. He's got a gun. We are now going to show you an enhanced version of the two body camera videos spliced together. The Bureau of Criminal Apprehension contracted with the National Center for Audio and Video Forensics in California. In the first video, officers Ryan Kelly and Justin Schmidt spot a man matching the description from a 911 call. The video stabilized and analyzed, zooms in, freezes, and highlights a gun in Blevins' pocket at the beginning of the encounter. Put your hands up now! The officers can be heard trying to get him to put the weapon down. You got a gun! Yes, you do! Levins ignores the officers' commands and runs away. It's here in this enhanced video. Authorities say Blevins, inside that red circle, can be seen reaching for his gun and turning towards the officers. Once that weapon has been out, pointed at officers, uh, that is clearly a critical situation where deadly force must be used. At this point, the video marks stabilized and analyzed, slows down, and circles an object that now appears to be in Blevins' right hand. Slowed down and stabilized by a California forensic video firm. The officers open fire, <laughs> killing Blevins. One down. EMS fired our location. He hits the ground, and the gun slides away from his hand. I don't see that this man gave the cops any choice. 